Okay, so this is part two of why I think uh, QuickBooks sucks. Um, I have, I've, for years, I've been using QuickBooks Enterprise Desktop, and I just get extremely tired of the workarounds you have to use to get anything to function like like it should function. And I'm sure the engineers and software programmers at QuickBook are know what they're doing. They're very smart. But I think the reason the program sucks so bad, I've literally spent $500, 500 hours of my employees' time of writing spreadsheets with macros, with VLOOKUP, to do all kinds of simple stuff that QuickBooks should already do. And it's just so terrible. At, oh, I just did a whole video on it. My microphone wasn't working. Maybe it's a good thing it wasn't working because... I just get so frustrated with paying QuickBooks all this money and their program really sucks. But it could be made so much better if they would just, you know, um, if they would just get feedback from people that actually use the program. You know, if you're, if you're a whimsical uh, Etsy store selling cupcakes or something, this is going to work fine for you, but if you're trying to run a warehouse and a real business with stocking items, it just, I don't get how they do it. But anyway, so this, what we're looking at here on the screen is called an inventory reorder report by vendor. So anybody in business knows that when you buy something from somebody to resell, you're buying that from your vendor. Okay. You also know that you might have a stock number for that item and the vendor might have their own stock number for that item. The vendor might update theirs or change theirs where you might update or change your stock number. But your stock numbers aren't always the same. Sometimes they are. Sometimes we'll use the same stock number as the vendor. But usually we have our own stock item number and then the vendor or the manufacturer has what they call an MPN, which is a manufacturer part number or a vendor number. So looking at the screen here, you can see up on top here, this is an inventory, inventory reorder report by vendor. Awesome report, man. I love this report. It's the best QuickBooks. I can't believe you've done all this work to this report to make it so great. Look, I can print this report. I can, I can print the report. I can save it as a PDF. I can even email this. I can send as an Excel file. I can send as a PDF. I mean, isn't that amazing that you could do that? I mean, I'm just flabbergasted with, that you're able to send this report to somebody. Now, this report is absolutely worthless because it has our part numbers on here. There's no way to change the report to make the report what it says it actually is. Inventory reorder report by vendor. Okay, you're keeping track of inventory. You want to reorder it by your vendor. So you would need your part number and the vendor's part number. That way you could look at it and know, oh, I need 10 of these. That's a good seller or whatever. And then when your vendor gets the report or if you send this to the vendor and say, hey, can you update my prices? Are these in stock? I don't want to give you a PO number for it yet until I, until I know the situation. But it's absolutely amazing how much money you spend or pay QuickBooks to all their stuff is like this too. I, I can point out 50 things that are just like this and it's so terrible. I mean, you guys could make this program so good by just listening to some of us people that actually use the program. It's just absolutely terrible. I mean, you got to use all these third party softwares like Z access to bring stuff in and out of QuickBooks. And it's just terrible. I mean, I've spent myself, I've spent 200 hours on this thing, figuring out workarounds and how to use this program to, to make it work like it should work. I've paid my employees 500 hours to do this goofy stuff. And it just doesn't make sense. QuickBooks I wish, you know what, I wish you could tell me how this works and I'm, Rick sucks. Hey, this is QuickBooks and Rick sucks because you can do this easily. We'll show you how to do this. I'd love for you to show me how to do this. 
Oh my goodness. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Uh, subscribe. Uh, thank you.